Well, Lindo Mari for the point after, and so it takes just 2.02 for Miami to come into Arizona and take the lead over San Diego. Are you ready for some football? Oops. This is like playground football. He said, you get in the shotgun, the Dolphins come in a blitz, now just come out here to the left. You see, he's going to start out here and just scramble to the left. Now, all this is doing is buying time. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. That buys a time so that this can happen on the other end. Hello, folks, and welcome. He had another year of Athey Creek's Harvest Festival. Here we are, right here at the football toss. Turning back with me a moment as we take a look at the history of the game. Way back in November 6, 1869, the first football game was played between two college football teams, Rutgers, Princeton. A tough, brutal, hard-fought game it was, and still today, the game is played in the same spirit, with the same power. I want you to take a look at some of the rules, some of the guidelines of the game, as we look here at our instructional manual. that you pay close attention as we look at our rules and our guidelines of the game. Because without skill, without accuracy, you just might not win a prize. So, we're going to run you through a couple of guidelines, a few drills you might say, on how the game is to be played. First, let's pause for our national anthem. Oh, say can you see? But I need the words. Whose bright stars and bright stars Bright and bright stars and the heavenly light Over the ramparts we watch We're so gallantly streaming We're so gallantly fleeing And the rocket's red glare The bombs bursting in air Okay, enough of that. Let's get back to the warm-up. Tai Chi. Would you? Tai Chi. Would you? As you can see, folks, the players depicted here use several different methods of preparing for the game. What matters for you is that you're ready when it's time for you to do the big toss. What do you say we work on some drills now?
want to warn you folks, a lot of bad stuff can happen when you don't warm up. Let's have a look here and see what I mean. We're having a sports blunder jam session. And there's no place to hide. How lucky can he was completely blessed like the fella said tell me quick ain't that a kick to some ribs witness a mysterious long jump technique now who can deny that when you actually do make the ball through the hoop it's time to celebrate Okay, now let's get back to our football skills. Give me some push-ups, now! Let's go, move, 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 come on! Good form, good form, man. Good form. You two, give me some sit-ups, now! Yeah, keep those feet down, kid. As you get closer to your turn in the football toss, please follow some basic stretches to get your arms ready. And if you don't know how to do this, please follow our trained professionals here on this instructional video. Cut your toes. Okay, now jump up and down, just trying to get warmed up. As you can see, folks, here at our training facility, we highly value and practice stretching and warm-up. Let me recommend to you right now that uh, in order to prevent injury, and accidents that you should spend the time in line training up and warming up and stretching out before your opportunity comes to do the football toss. At this time gentlemen we're going to do some up downs. Ready? As you can see here, there are many different styles and methods of throwing the ball. You should pick the one that you like the best. You've got the granny throw, the standard overhand throw, 
And then uh, once you become more comfortable, you could even try some trick throws, as you'll see here. And for extra bonus candy, you might even want to try to kick a field goal. Remember folks, no pushing, shoving, or taking cuts. Y por favor, no se debe de empujar y mantenga sus manos adentro a todo tiempo. Gracias. And another thing, whatever you do, work at it with all your heart as working for the Lord and not for men. Thanks for joining us.